In 1938, did he was he a proponent of the two nation theory, or or did it happen towards the turn of the 1940s and in the run up to 1947? So if that happened, then should that person be glorified and put amongst those greats who championed the idea of India and fought for the freedom of this country? Ilya Shrafuddin, where do you stand? See, I strongly believe that anyone talking about division in Indian society in subcontinent should not be glorified anywhere. Either it is Muhammad Ali Jinnah. In the Aligarh Muslim University or Savarkar in the Parliament, none should be glorified who want hate among the Indians. None should be glorified when they want to destroy India and the Indianness and unity and harmony in our nation. So Savarkar's portrait should be thrown out from the Parliament. So do Jinnah's portrait from the Aligarh Muslim University.